Pastor Julien Haguruka Chane Stand up May God bless you Clap for her once more yeah. Pastor Julien Thank you for being with us tonight It's not her first time to be with us She's a dear friend She's a dear friend And she's a dear friend And she's a dear friend She's a dear friend And 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 she's a dear friend Hallelujah. God bless you. God bless you, Pastor Julien. She's the wife of Pastor Kabanda. And they have a church called Jubilee. May God bless you. Pastor Julien, are you here? 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 If she sings here and preaches here, may you come next time and preach to us. May God bless her. Thank you for your testimony. Thank you for your testimony. Thank you for your testimony. Thank uh, please forgive me if I, I didn't see you and acknowledge you. But you know that yesterday we welcomed you and honored you and we stood together. And I also welcome Apostle Mignon who is leading Women Foundation Ministries. The noble me people are sometimes get angry. Do you know that you are our senior pastor? Why do you mention women and forget about noble family church? Bear with me yeah. because the Women Foundation Ministry started some, uh, sometimes some years back. Among the people I welcome yesterday, uh, there are people who were with us yesterday. We spoke about Europe, but we have 49 people from France. Let's clap for them. We have diaspora members, 1,200. And we have 12 more who are coming tonight. They say they just want to join. May God bless you. eighty-six people in Kigali. It's a miracle from God. We have 50 countries in Africa. From Africa. Fifty countries from Africa. And it is written down. Amen. So ego. women foundation continent to the gates. In, in Women Foundation Ministries continents, we call them gates. So, gatekeepers. And the coordinators of those gates are called gatekeepers. We want to thank all the gatekeepers who have come. If you are here and you are leading a gate or a chapter, Women Foundation Ministries. In Women Foundation Ministries. May you, may you stand up if you are here. Others are in service. Chapter. If you are leading a chapter or a gate, Let's clap for these women and ladies. Even the men who are leading the men of Issachar. May you be seated and may God bless you. In Africa Gate, we have 50 countries, as I say. Europe, we have Europe, from Europe, 15 countries. Yeah, North America, if Tibugu we believe, America and Canada. North America has U.S. and Canada. Asia, if Tibugu we turn. In Asia, we have five countries. Have we about Magma Kumya Biri Nabata Tumuri Asia? And 23 people came from Asia. Chumi Nabata Tumuri Asia Mubushinwa. And 13 has come from China. Muri Oseani has Tibugu we believe. And Oseania, we have two countries. Dufte Australia, Dufte Nahinda Hitwa New Zealand. And we have from Australia and New Zealand. Dero Abo Banwo Se Nijumbi Magana Biri Nabirongre Nabata. And all of them are 
86. In the vision, it says the taxes yeah. will increase. Yeah. When people are consuming, uh, uh, the, the taxes increase. I thank God that they are drinking water from Rwanda and buying milk. And don't fast, please. Please. Consume those. When we will come to your countries, we will also not fast. Amen. Please visit the hotels and restaurants. Yeah, so God bless you. Thank you so much. What am I going to talk about? Pastor Matthew Matthew I will welcome Pastor Matthew as, 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 as he enters his, it is his last time. When I have such preachers, I want to learn myself. You know, there are people who are saying, why don't you take time and preach? But I also want to learn. Even the doctors sometimes get sick and they are <laughs> I'm not that so sick. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. I, I am thirsty for the next level. I am a woman married to her husband with the four children. After the name after my child, I'm called Mama Baraka. I am a member of Adeper Church where I stay in Kigali. Clap for the Lord. I am that woman. I am blessed to testify in front of people like you in front of my apostle that I love so dearly. May God bless her. I am that woman who was oppressed. I was born like other people. And then I was called to serve God when I was still young. Then I got married. Thinking that I'm going to enter into my joy. And then I went through struggles, yet I had spoken with God. To the extent that I couldn't even clothe my firstborn. When I gave birth to my secondborn, because I had gone through a C-section, I couldn't pay 8,000 Rwanda francs. I flee from the hospital. But today, you can see that I cannot run away from the hospital. Just the, se the way I am dressed tonight. Why did it happen like that? I thank God who still has his people. In that struggle, God had told me that he will bless me. But I could look at my life and look for ways to get out of that and couldn't find it. But I thank God that he has ways. Because of the bitterness in life, there was a good person. That person told me, you, can, you will become great. I could, and he said, I, I can see you driving a car. Don't look at the circumstances you are in. Can you allow me to pay for your car? Uh, to learn how to drive a car. Because God is telling me that you are going to drive yourself. 
I could see that it is impossible because of being a victim. But God, praise be to God, who has given us a mother, who has given us a spiritual authority, the anointing that is upon her life, and God gave her that vision among the women she has to impact. I am among them. Them. She called me not looking at where I am from. And she told me, come and preach the gospel. The first day I reached to the heart, the anointing that is upon her life has uncovered me. I loved myself. I started dressing up well. I am a woman who can fly. I go to different countries. Today I am a champion. Hallelujah. 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 Because of that anointing upon her life, it's not about flying planes only. Today, my household, my marriage is among the best marriages. My husband can drive himself. And myself, I came driving myself. My husband asked me this day. He asked me, are you the one driving or it is me who is going to drive? Today I drive myself in the city of Kigali. Hallelujah. As I wind up, Today I have a prayer request I, that I'm praying for. Pray the growth of praise. May he touch on the eyes of the people in this world. May they understand the anointing of God upon her life. Because there are people who are still doubting. Because of the darkness they are still in. I'm praying for them to be touched by God. For them to understand the person who is going to... I am living in Kigali today. I go home driving myself. <laughs> the one who will go... Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. 